Hello everyone, this is Vanessa G. I am back with a haul, y'all. A Dollar Tree haul. My last haul was Walmart haul. And I kept saying I forgot something, I'm missing something. Well, I found it, I was missing something. So I'm gonna have a small amount of Walmart with my Dollar Tree haul. I guess we'll finish with what I had in the Walmart haul. Um, it's a bag here. While I was in there, I found some hats for a dollar. Okay. And I found a, a black one. But what I really, really liked were the pink hats that were there. So let's see. These are regular $5 hats, $4.97. And this one... Ooh, this one was $7.97. I don't know what the difference is between this one and this one. This black one says breathable, reflective, lightweight, and it does, it does have a nice feeling to it. It almost feels stretchy. But um, it's $8 instead of that $5. I don't know. Anyway, I, li I like it. Let's see. Color is black soot. But um, mm, it's interesting, even with the back part. Guys, I have a big head, and sometimes these tend to hurt in here. But what I did with the pink hats, I saw these, and I thought this would be so nice for Gigi and her girls, my daughter and my granddaughters. I bought one for each one of us. And I'm going to put a special design on the hat so that we can wear them and we can go out and maybe even take some pictures. I will show you the hats when, once I finish with it. It's a nice little craft. But I bought, I think seven. Anyway, these are for the girls and myself. So I'm gonna put these back in this bag and that I think is all that I had that was part of that Walmart haul. Now for the Dollar Tree. I have seen these in Dollar Tree before. Um, these are the dish racks for the plates and I've seen different people do different things with them. I am going to put this, I only bought one. I'm going to put it in my office and use it as a divider to hold up my papers or my notebooks. I'm not sure yet, but I'm going to put it in here. And I'll make it work. Now, I love, love, love peach. And when I saw these, somebody had them. I guess they changed their mind about them. And I picked them up. These are three of the book designs. I have several of these in here. So I'm just going to add these to my collection. Or maybe even hold them for something else. I have great ideas for DIYs also. But I've, I've got that. Now. Oh. And you're familiar with these. Um, the shelf hold. Not the shelf hold. The little cubby cubby holders but I found some beautiful ones I love this these designs I actually saw someone else haul them I don't remember exactly who it was but if you notice originally I, I got one black bookshelf over here with these others and I thought about that bookshelf I was actually going to put it somewhere else and I was going to use these in the bookshelf but I have so so many books. I don't even have enough room for my books. But I love this design. And I picked up, let's see, two, three, four, four of these. And I thought it would be nice to have um, the ultimate color there. So I really am not sure what I'm going to do with it. And then I got the large one. So I've got uh, the two, four, six, six small ones and this large one. I don't know, I'll do something with it. 
And excuse the bag rally, and I was trying to have it all together, guys, but um, I decided to put everything up here so that I'll have them all. And I found some more of my jars, so I'm going to have four of these. There's another one in the bag over here. Um, oh. My son, um, he loves, I've got to stop hitting that desk and shaking you guys. He loves the socks, the special designer socks. And again, it's a hit or miss. It looks as if when they have them in, they have a ton. And when they don't, they have just a basic. But I thought about crafty DIY guy. He loves the socks also. But I got my son this one. And this one, I love this one. And this one makes me think about, you know, I told you about the funky thing. It makes me think about that. And this one is really funky. This one. And I got him some guitars. And the emojis. So I got him those. I like picking things up when I see them. By the time I give them to my children, it's normally around a gift giving time. So he'll get that. Maybe, I don't know, maybe I'll give it to him on Father's Day or whatever, his birthday. And this is just another one of those jars that I told you about. So now I have a total of four. Now. While I was at the Dollar Tree, before I went to I went to Walmart and then Dollar Tree, I found some hats. And again, I bought the hats. And my whole idea is to decorate them and make them girly girly. I don't know. I picked up some rhinestones and some other things. But when I do when I finish them, I don't know. I may do a DIY or I may just show them to you once they're finished. But I got the first one is navy and then tan. And I got a black. And I got a cream. Let's see, and at first I thought these two were the same color, but once I look closely, they're not. See that? So I love wearing caps, but I, I prefer to have girly girl caps. So I'm going to decorate these. I have some more caps already which is why I decided to make girly girl caps with those. And I don't know, I may have to give an extra one to my granddaughter that I was telling you about that loves girly girl things. She watches Gigi and when I get dressed, I never forget when I realized she was a girly girl dressed girl, I had an orange belt that had rhinestones um, attached to the belt and she, picked my belt up and I saw her she was looking at the belt and she she whispered Gigi will you buy me a belt like that I thought it was so sweet and that's when I realized I had a girly girl but y'all I found these candle holders are they not absolutely gorgeous and again my favorite color peach I saw these first, and just a little further on that same aisle, I saw these. And this gold reminded me of this. I just knew they would go perfectly together. And by the way, I did pick up some of these in another haul. Well, not another haul. I've been doing Dollar Tree since Dollar Tree first came into existence. When I started going to Dollar Tree, it was not the popular thing to go, the place to go. Uh, I, people were actually turning their nose up when I mentioned Dollar Tree as if they, were, ew, they wouldn't go. But now you see all types of people going to the Dollar Tree. I think I've been going to Dollar Tree since Dollar Tree was first opened. But anyway, I thought this was so, oh, well, it's not going to work there. But I knew the color scheme would be together. I, I, I'm going to do something with the two of these together. But um, I just thought that would be so beautiful, the two together. I don't know. But I'll figure it out. 
the, the color combination is just perfect. And even at, oh, I just noticed that even at the bottom. But <clears throat> anyway, I got, I think I got three of these. And I did because there were three, this one, three were on the shelf. And a little further up, there were three of these. What are they called? Hanging lamps. Again, I did buy some more, and I've got quite a few of them. I was going to do something in the yard in the summertime. I love decorating in the summertime, the yard. I feel like that's just an extension of the home. But anyway, that's nice. So we're going to put this over here. And again, I did get three. And then three. All right. What do we have here? Oh, that's some more of the same product. Okay. I have purchased these numerous times, these little laundry bags. Um, I like, I hate putting my, um, my bras. Why am I opening this? <laughs> I don't need, anyway, since I've done it. They're not that large, but what I like to do is put my socks and my bras in here. But this doesn't last that many times, that many washes, even on delicate. When I do wash my bras in the washing machine, I'll put them in here so the straps don't get all tangled up. And I thought it would be a good idea to take that square, zip it up, and then maybe put it in here that's not very large, but I'm trying to figure out how to make that mesh last longer. If you can think of something, um, please put it in the bottom. But I hate, I hate washing my bras when I hand wash them. It's so tedious. So I'll cheat sometime and put it in the machine. Undelicate and it still gets caught up. So that's not the best. Oh. Also, I have this Himalayan pink salt, the bath salt. I finally found this, and I'm not sure who it was that I saw with this, but I love the jar style bag and it zipped back up. But I absolutely love this. I actually like, this would be something that I would put in a clear jar like this on the side of my bathroom. But I actually like this little packaging. I think this is cute to put on the side of the tub and open it and close it. So that was neat. I enjoyed that. Some other things that I got, and I've seen other people haul them, are the Aroma Guru Rub-On. Um, the lavender, the tea tree. I love tea tree. I also found, what is this one? Um, this is Muscle Ease, which is a combination. Okay, Muscle Ease has wintergreen, eucalyptus, peppermint, ginger, black pepper, turmeric, and nutmeg. And this does work, guys. Also, I got the peppermint, which I love, love, love peppermint. So those were some things that I picked up. I also found just one book this time, and it's the Hungry Girl Clean and Hungry Obsessed. All natural recipes for the food you can't live without. Now, I have not looked um, in detail at these recipes, but I saw the pictures and I was so, and I do hope that once I get in here that they are clean. Oh, I saw some fruit there, but I am going to get back off of that candy, guys. Okay, looks like uh, down to the last spot. Okay. I found these glass jars, and again, they, they're they clear, and I, I love this. Again, the salt would be nice in that, or you could put it <clears throat> at your coffee area, put some coffee in here that's been ground, 
look at this is this not beautiful look at I, I love the way it feels but I love that and I love this one look I think these are so neat even though they are different styles you can make this work with an arrangement that's absolutely beautiful and I've got a couple more let's see what we're working with here oh that's oh, the same so that's I got two of those no I really must I must have really enjoyed that I have three of these those are beautiful now I'm always picking these up three for a dollar they're great to have around it's great for holding your pencil and other little knickknacks when you need it <clears throat> excuse me also I got some craft glue for the hats again I'm not sure I have an idea of what I want to do but I'm not sure what I'm going to do it will all work out and it will be fabulous once I finish with it. I'm excited about making it and showing it to you. Oh, look what I found. One more book. Kindness Kittens. This is so sweet. It's about some cats, some kittens rather, and them learning kindness. And again, I thought this would be so nice for my grandsons to read because they are at that age where they're learning kindness. And again, the oldest one can read it to the smaller ones. I don't know, I think I'll have, maybe make them some cookies and milk or something and let them have a boy's time reading their books. But that's all I have for that haul. And I am so grateful that you stopped by to see my YouTube haul. Thank you, thank you, thank you for being a part of my family, for being my friend. Please like and subscribe. Tell others about me. And until next time, I look forward to seeing you, my friend. Bye-bye.